Hey everyone, welcome to Learning High. If you are a VTU student preparing for the National Language Processing Exam with subject code BAD613B and aiming for 70 plus marks, you are in the right place. In this video, I'll walk you through the most important questions of Module 1 you absolutely cannot miss. And if you want in-depth explanations about each and every question, and access to most important questions of all the other modules, which would be extremely helpful for your last minute preparation, you can click on the link in the description below, which will help you score 80 plus marks in the VTU exam. Starting with question number one, what is NLP? List and explain applications of NLP. NLP is nothing but natural language processing. So we start by giving a small introduction of what is the meaning of NLP and its history. Starting with heuristic based NLP, statistical and machine learning based NLP and neural network based NLP as well. Applications of NLP, sentiment analysis, text classification, chatbot and virtual assistants, text extraction, machine translation, and market intelligence. There are a few extra speech recognition, email filters, customer support. So explanation under each subheading is important, which will fetch your marks. Question number two, list and explain different phases of analysis in natural language processing with an example for each. So these are the phases. Explanation of each of the phase. For more detailed explanations of other topics and modules, check the link in the description. These video explanations are created by expert video professors to help you score 80 plus in your semester exams. Starting with lexical analysis, syntax analysis, semantic analysis, discourse integration, pragmatic analysis, and that is it. This flowchart is also important, which might fetch you, fetch you a few marks. Question number three, describe C structure and F structure in LFG. LFG is nothing but lexical functional grammar. So explain what is C structure and then F structure along with the example for both. Question number four, construct the surface structure and deep structure for the following sentences. The police will catch the snatchers. She saw stars in the sky. So the rules to construct the surface structure and deep structure analysis, uh, the uh, surface structure and deep structure is given in our video course. You can access it by clicking the link in the description below. Our video faculty, expert faculty has explained how to convert this into different stru structures. The solution and explanation is important. Question number five, write C structure and F structure for the sentence. She saw stars using the CFG rules as below. There are a few set of rules given which you're supposed to follow to, construct, to convert C structure into F structure for the following sentence. Here's a solution. Explanation to the solution is also given in our video course. You can access it by clicking on the link in the description box where our video faculty have explained on how to solve questions like this. Not only this question, but any similar question with the same pattern. Question number six, explain the role of transformational rules in transformational grammar with the help of an example. First, we explain the role of transformational rules and its base structure. For more detailed explanations of other topics and modules, check the link in the description. These video explanations are created by expert video professors to help you score 80 plus in your semester exams. Parse structure, sorry. 
And question number seven, find the probability of test sentence given below if a bigram model is used on the following training sentences. So these are the, these are the training sentences. We need to calculate the probability of test. So again, the rules of calculating the probability of test is explained by our week two faculty. You can access our course by clicking on the link in the description below. Yeah, you will be able to understand how this is done. Question number eight. Describe the Paninian framework for Indian languages. Explain the layered representation of Paninian grammar and character theory. It's a complete theoretical question, which is which should carry almost 10 marks. We have to give a lot of theory in it uh, with its history and all the levels, semantic level, character level, vibhakti level, and surface level. And all the theories, character theory, various characters. Under each explanation is required. For more detailed explanations of other topics and modules, check the link in the description. These video explanations are created by expert video professors to help you score 80 plus in your semester exams.